Good morning, boys and girls, and welcome to Shen Plays. I'm your host, Shenru, and today we're playing as Malaya here in Europa Universalis 4. Uh, we keep getting events for cores to come in. I don't think there's any Quebec. Oh, there is! There's Quebec! Canada? No. No Canada, but there is a lot of Quebec cores, so that's cool. Maybe Quebec will spawn. Oh, there's even some in my territory. I didn't get any notification. Yeah. Uh, maybe we can have some uh, some countries spawn. Maybe the USA, maybe Canada, Quebec. What about uh, Haiti? No, there's no Haiti. No Cuba. There is uh, United Provinces of Central America and Colombia. I didn't see anything for Peru yet, but we did get Paraguay and no, no Brazil. What about Venezuela? No, no Venezuela. All right, well, there's some. Uh, usually they don't all spawn. You usually only get a few of them, but hopefully we'll get some. That'd be nice, you know? A little variety on the map. Why not? In the meantime, we're trying to get Malwa out of this damn coalition. We have them at good relations. Plus 30. It's not bad. They're just... They're still in the coalition. They just, they just don't like us. They're real dicks. Oh, yeah, we gotta get Yemen to like us again. Fuck me. Yemen has us as a rival? Really? Why would you do that, Yemen? Seriously, why the hell would you even consider doing that? You little fucker. Uh, that's going to screw things up. Because they've been a good ally for years. Oh, man. I think we're going to have to stop the annexation of Marathas here. We're already halfway done, but I need them out of the coalition. Leave the coalition. Rod, Todd, this is God. Leave the coalition. Still two years ahead. We should probably spend those points. Spend those points. Force a PU on them. Oh, we can do whatever, but I mean, they're they're almost small enough to vassalize. We just need them to release Nepal. The problem right now is just. They're in the coalition. We need them to leave the coalition. If you would kindly ask them to leave the coalition, that'd be great. Oh yeah, force the union on Yemen. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, you know what? Why not? They have shit for allies. Hmm. Can I claim their throne? Uh, no. I can't claim their throne right now. That's too bad. That is a good point, though. Yemen wants an alliance back. Oh, I'm not on your rival list anymore. Uh, That hurts. I hate doing that. Hey, you rivaled me. It's your own fault. You little bastard. Get out of there. Stop improving relations with them. They're dirty. Don't touch them. Stupid you men. Who does he think he is? Putting me on his rival list. What kind of jerk does that? Alright. Uh, well, we're not going to tech up. So let's do some Diplo buildings. That means more docks. Uh, whoa, wait, whoa, wait. What's after docks? Dock, dock, goose? No, 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 Docks. Dry docks. We've already done the dry docks. Okay. Shipyard. That's what we want. This one actually gives you plus one to your force limits for your navy. So A, it makes your navy cheaper, and B, it allows you to build more ships. Fantastic.
why are they not leaving the coalition? We're at plus 32. What else can I even do? We're at plus 32. And he's like, I don't want to leave the coalition. <laughs> Kanata patriots. They're going to flip to Hindustan. God damn it. Awesome has insulted us. Yeah, but they're still in the coalition. Oh, no, they left the coalition. Well, I would love to annex you, Awesome, but I'm trying to stay good so that Malwa will leave us alone. Can you dig? Oh, I know you can dig. God damn it, Malwa. Damn it, Malwa. Come on, I'm at 70%. Oh, man. Man. It's just not cool, you know? It's just not cool. Okay, more shipyards. More naval force limits. Wow, we're running out of money quick. Ah, they're expensive buildings, sort of. Joe has inherited Shun. Oh my goodness, Joe inherited Lan Zhang, and now they've inherited Shun. You're kidding me. Holy crap. Well, there's still cores all over. Still, wow. Craziness. Ooh, more missionary strength. Nice. Oh, that makes conversions so much faster. God damn it, Joe. You guys are just badass. Japan's back in the coalition. That's fine, but Malwa needs to leave it. Leave it. I can't believe Japan has a personal union over Ostrakhan. That is just the weirdest thing. Oh, plus 43. What the hell? Diviet left the coalition. Okay. Diviet will leave the coalition against us at negative 68. But Malwa will not leave the coalition against us. No matter what we do. I'm out of ideas for Malwa. We're at plus 44. Come on. Malwa. Why are you such jerk? I mean, if that's the way it's going to be, I'm just going to go declare war on Diviet and Baroda and just annex all these idiots. I'm sick of this crap, Malwa. Why you've got to be such a jerk? But if we do that, if we start a war, because we can go to war with Awesome and Baroda and Diviet, anyone who's not in the coalition, we can start this war right now. But if we do that, Malwa will never, ever come back within range of vassalization. Because we're getting in the range where they'll vassalize. But that'll never happen if we go to war. Ooh, better relations. Snatch him up. Ooh, more coffee. I like it. Book burning. Gain piety. Yeah, please. Thank you for the piety. And I think that's it for the colonies. Britain's going to get... Yeah, Britain already have one. Fine. That is it for the colonies. Wow. Interesting. Well, that's all we can do in the Americas. So... Um, hmm, hmm, hmm. Let's go join up with the rebel hunters, I guess. Rebel Hunters.
Yeah, but Malwa shouldn't be outraged anymore. We've been at peace for years. Oh, Malwa. Oh, right, right, right. We can keep coring. I mean, we can keep colonizing. You're right. Uh, let me recruit a couple derps over here. I must not forget to colonize. We are so close to annexing Marathas. I mean... It's just one province, but it's a base six. It's a base six. I don't know if I can live with myself if I let them keep a base six tax. Nope, we're going to do it. We're going to cancel it. God damn, I can't believe I'm doing this. Well, of course I can believe I'm doing this. I've done this in other LPs. Okay, okay. Relax, Marathas. You know what? We can just start it again right now. There. <laughs> so we're starting back at zero. So we have seven more years. Come on, Malwa. Come on, Malwa. Oh, 995 points. We gotta use some of these. Naval equipment. Oh, no, 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 no. Let's do... Shipyards. Yeah. Britain declared war on Baroda. Oh, goodness. Baroda, you're going to get the axe, dude. You want an alliance? No. It's your own loss. I would totally defend you against Britain, dude. Anyone ever notice that Bundelkind is sort of shaped like a fat penis? It is. Malwa really needs to lead this coalition. They just do. It's been too long, my friend. Guarantee Baroda, it's too late. Oh shit, I built my units, but I never actually sent them over there. God damn it, Shen. And we're maxed on our military points. Let's spend some of those. Get me an Amadis. No, they're all done. Okay. Oh, no, they're not. There we go. And training fields. Good. Come on, Mawa. Come on, Mawa. Why are they so stubborn? I don't get it. Oh, everyone's declaring war on Baroda. Are we still ahead of time? Nope, we're right on time. Okay, good. Okay, good. Oh, Latin Coirisers. Nice. Bingo. Come on, Malwa! Don't do this to me, bro. Broski, Broheim, something or other. No, I'm not going to do the abolition of slavery. Sorry. Sorry, Charlie. Can I claim your throne yet? No. Dang it. We're at plus 50, and this fucker won't get out of the coalition against us. Come on! Oh, there we go! Finally! Yay! Then the coalition! Alright! 
It's wartime, baby. I wish you would have done that while Nepal still existed. Because I could have vassalized Nepal and given them a whole lot of land. But no, you have to be a douche nozzle. Senor Douche Nozzle, otherwise known as Malwa. Okay. War. Oh, military access. Derp. Military access. There we go. Border friction. Either lose tech points or piss off Britain. Fine, piss off Britain. Who the fuck cares about Britain? Another change of throne in Kazan. Well, that's not news. Okay, well, royal marriage or not, it's um, time for war, my friend. Mein Freund. Okay, 27 of you to split in half. I want um, over there and over there. Go to the capital. Whatever. You guys can split in half and go there. And there. And that should be enough, I think, because my vassal will invade too. Oh no, the Mughals have joined against us. Not the Mughals! Not the Mughals. Oh, hello, Malwa. Hello. Hello. Jolly good show. Uh, do I have a general? No. I will create for you a general. Here, have a conquistador. Hey, a 6-5 conquistador. Not bad. And, uh, yeah, that's gonna be nice. Squish! Well, there goes Malwa's army. Lol. Yeah, seriously, that, that was Malwa's army. So, about that province I wanted. Yeah, just siege everything. In fact, bring up some buddies. Because why not? What could possibly go wrong? Oh, Malwa. Lose stability. No, I'm not going to lose stability. Sorry. Sorry, broski. Broheim. Well, I'm not even sure I need these extra guys, but I brought them over. I'll, I'll make use of them or something. Or something. God, I can't believe they annexed Nepal. That's not cool, bro. Not cool. Now the problem is, I bet we can't even make them release Nepal. I bet it's more than 100% war score to release Nepal. No, it's exactly 100%. Ugh. So I can't do that and give Kandesh to my vassal. I can't do both things. Oh, god damn it. That's so frustrating. Okay. Oh, what the? Oh. Hmm? I don't know. And there was a bulb. I saw the bulb, and then I can't use the bulb. The bulb is gone. There is no bulb. There was no bulb. It was, um, it was a trick of the eye. All right, so, let's see. We're already doing, uh, Ogaden, and that's the only one we can do over here. Okay. Well, it looks like it's time for Australia. Australia. Indeed. We could do some of these over here, but they're not part of the Asia continent, so I don't care. Russia declared war on Kazan. Well, that will... Oh, Louisiana's independence. Okay. Oh, there's another province over here. Well, 
not for long. Okay, there goes Kandesh. So if we wanted to release Kandesh, we would not be able to... I mean, if we wanted to give Kandesh to our vassal, we wouldn't be able to release Nepal. That kind of pisses me off. We have to do one or the other. Isn't that dumb? It's pretty dumb. And yeah, Britain's just going to annex these guys. Whistler. I'm the bestest little whistler in the world. Little whistler, you're the one. Neener, neener, lots of fun. Something, something. Dark side. Come on, hurry up with this shit. Why you take so longs? Yemen wants an alliance again. Can I claim your throne yet? No. Go away. God, I'm going to piss him off if I keep telling him no. And it's not like Yemen's been a bad ally. They've been pretty good. Yeah, bye-bye, Baroda. That was my thing, Britain. God damn it, Britain. Little jerk. Chagtai, Korea, and Joe. So a war with Korea would be good. Yeah, Tibet. That's their only ally. Ooh. Ooh, all right. All righty then. Damn, I should have done that earlier. Uh, Nepal has a core here in Jharkhand, so I could have taken that and released Nepal. Oh, that would have been good. Because then we could have just forced Mawa to sell stuff to Nepal. But uh, I didn't do that early enough, did I? No, I done screwed it up. Oh well. Seslavis. Nepal's land isn't very good. Base 6, base 7, base 2, base 6, base 5, base 2. That's not good. Are you crazy? You out your goddamn mind. All right, so Sindh has a next. Hooray. Hooray, Sindh. Okay, group up. Get over there and kill some motherfuckers. Kill some mofos. And I don't need your little shippy ships. Look at those crappy ships that he has. My goodness. My goodness. 82% uh, because of that one province. Okay, I'm going to send like half of my army over there. Everyone else just go home. Stupid little bastard over there. No, I don't want your alliances. Go away. Go away, I said. Converted Pigu. Good. Guys, conversions just get easier and easier as uh, time goes on. Russia declared war on Japan. Oh, that's nice. Just assault the fort. 
What could go wrong? There we go, 100%. All right. So, we could release Nepal, or we could just uh, give that to my vassal. He will. That's 32, which is nice. And uh, Nepal would be any of that crap. Well, why don't we take Bihar? And then uh, we can go to war with Tibet later and make them release a whole bunch of shit. Uh, I don't want to rack up too much infamy with all of our neighbors. I want them to stay somewhat neutral. Uh, you can keep all your crappy allies. I don't really care. Give me your trade power and uh, can you revoke some cores? Well, no, actually, if he keeps some... No, you can get rid of that one. Mm, keep the rest, though. That's fine. Give me some dollars. I like dollars. Okay, good. Uh, I'm not even going to bother coring it. I'm going to release them. Great. Hello, Nepal. And, of course, they're my religions. So we can get a marriage and blah, blah, blah. Um, distance between borders is causing a 10,000 penalty in that peace deal offer. Well, that's nice to know. All right. You guys, come down here. And uh, we need to get relations back up with Malwa again. Unfortunately, they're a little upset over, you know, taking land from them, but... Oh well, we do need to end the episode here. Thank you guys for joining me today. Um, next time, we're probably going to be going to war with, uh, I think, Coria, Diviet, and if there's anything left of Baroda, we'll go get that. And awesome if we can get them out of that uh, coalition. I don't know. We'll find out next time. Have a good day, everybody.